today's video, tuturuan ko kayong maglagay ng animated subscribe button katulad nito. At kahit anong animated icons like bell button, like button, at marami pang iba. So grab your phone at tuturuan ko kayo kung paano mag-edit. So if you're interested, just keep on watching. So halos everyday guys, maraming nagme-message sa akin kung paano ba talaga mag-edit. Ano bang editing apps ang ginagamit ko? At marami din nagtatanong na paano ba talaga mag-add ng animated icons. Lalong-lalo na yung subscribe button. So ngayon, tuturuan ko kayo kung paano mag-animate ng icons gamit lang ang iyong phone. And guys, ito yung pinakamadaling paraan kung paano maglagay ng animated icons. This is actually a collaboration with my kuya. I invited him to make this tutorial since siya yung video editor ko since day one. After 2 years here in YouTube, ang rami na namin na-discover ng mga apps na sobrang dali gamitin for editing. Actually, ang raming ways para mag-add ng subscribe button, pero trust me, ito yung pinakamadaling paraan. So here's my Kuya Jorge to make you a tutorial on how to add animated subscribe button on your video. Hello guys, this is Jorge. Ako yung brother slash editor ni Giselle. So ako talaga yung nag edit ng mga videos niya, ng mga YouTube videos niya since day one. And she requested me to make this video. She want me to walk you through kung paano mag-add ng mga animated icons like subscribe button. May tatong apps akong ituturo sa inyo today. So the easiest one here is PixArt. Ito talaga yung ginagamit namin frequently guys pag nag add kami ng mga animated icons. So for example this one guys, ito yung clip niya sa kanyang outro. Okay, so let's say mag-add tayo ng subscribe button. Punta ka lang dito sa stickers. Ito, stickers. And then just type in subscribe. So let's choose subscribe and then bell. And then, punta tayo dito sa Jiffy. Ito. Okay, so may makikita ko ng mga animated subscribe button dito guys that you can choose from. Ito yung gusto mo kasi may subscribe button and then bell button. Okay, so nandito na siya guys. You can actually reposition it. Let's say gusto mo dito sa gitna. Then you can also adjust the size of the icon. Okay, so ganyan. Ganyan mga kadali, diba? But the thing here is, hindi ka nakaka-decide kung kailan mo siya gusto i-add. Kasi from the beginning of the video, ando na agad yung so sticker or yung icon. So, hindi ka makaka-decide kung kailan mo siya gusto mag-pop up. For example, gusto mo siyang i-add in the middle. Pero hindi mo siya magagawa dito sa app itself. And also, since may bayad yung PixArt, hindi mo mare-remove yung watermark. Tingnan nyo, may watermark dito, right? So, hindi masyadong professional tingnan yung video mo because of the watermark. Pero guys, don't you worry. Meron tayong paraan dyan. So, ito lang yung gagawin natin, guys. Let's go to Fonto. This one, yung my letter P, and then color red yung icon niya. So, let's choose Fonto. And then, i-click lang natin tong camera icon. Punta tayo sa plain image. And then, piliin natin yung color green. Let's make it a little greener. Ito. Ito, yun. Kasi guys, the reason why we need to do this is para sa green screen natin mamaya. Which I will explain to you later. Now let's change the size kasi since square yung size niya, let's change it to the typical YouTube video size. Landscape one. Ayan. Color green na ba siya? Ayan. 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 So, let's go ahead and save it. Okay, so the next step is punta tayo sa iMovie. You can also do it in KineMaster, guys, if you don't have the iOS or the iPhone. But here, we will be using iMovie. Okay, so piliin natin yung green screen natin kanina. And then, let's just make a very short clip for this. At least around 8 seconds. Ayan. And then just hit done. And then let's go ahead and save the video. Okay, now that we're done making our green screen, let's go back to PixArt. 
And then let's choose the green screen video. Ayun. Ito yung ginawa natin kanina, right? So again, ulitin lang natin yung step natin kanina. Punta tayo sa sticker. Choose the subscribe bell. And then let's go to Jiffy. Then pipiliin na naman natin yung icon na ito. Okay lang na may makikita kayong text art or watermark dyan sa gilid kasi madidelete natin yan mamaya. I'll show you kung paano. So, isave muna natin to. Okay. So, now that we're done with our green screen, punta na naman tayo sa iMovie, guys. And then, let's create another movie. So, ito yung video natin kanina, yung outro ni Giselle. Okay, so gusto ko dito siya i-add sa part na ito. Yo, a big thumbs up. Yun, a big thumbs up. Pag sabi niya ng a big thumbs up, gusto ko dyan na part mag-pop up yung icon. So yung gagawin lang natin, just hit this cross sign. Ito. Or plus sign. And then go to video. Then recently added. Ito. Ito yung in-added natin kanina, di ba? Yung green screen with the animated subscribe button. So, i-click lang natin itong may tatlong dots, guys. And then, just hit green or blue screen. Ayan. So, let's see. This video, a big thumbs up kung gusto nyo. And subscribe kung hindi ka pa nakaka-subscribe. Just click the red button down below. And the notification bell beside para... So, parang hindi siya nagsasync in, di ba? Big thumbs up kung gusto nyo. And subscribe kung hindi ka pa nakaka-subscribe. Just click the red button down below. Parang mas... Mabilis yung animated icon natin. Hindi nag-sync in sa sinasabi ni Giselle. So, ang gagawin lang natin is, i-slow mo lang natin yung green screen. So, just click the green screen movie and then, slow mo natin ng at least two-third. Thumbs up from Gusenyo and subscribe if you don't subscribe. Just click the red button down below and the notification bell beside para updated ka sa mga bagong Okay, that's good. So, since may pix art pa dito guys, yung gagawin lang natin is ito. Ito yung gagawin natin guys para ma-delete siya. Just click this green screen and then meron ka makikita square or box icon dito. Just click that one. Tapos, O, oh, diba? Mawawala na siya, guys. Ganyan. So, hindi mo na makikita yung pix art, right? O, oh, diba? O, oh, diba? Wala na yung pix art sa gilid, guys. Amazing, right? You can move it around kung ano yung gusto mong i-delete sa screen. That's it. And then, if you want, you can add sound effect like this. Ito, punta tayo sa audio and then my music. Kasi doon mo makikita yung mga imported sound effects mo na dinownload mo from YouTube. So ito, ito lang yung ginagamit kong sound effect for subscribe button. Ano And then the click sound. Okay. In this video, a big thumbs up kung gusto nyo and subscribe kung hindi ka pa nakaka-subscribe. Just click. So that's it. You're good to go. And then you can just go ahead and save the video. So the other way, guys, is you can go to Google. Then just search for subscribe button. Okay, so pili ka lang dyan ang mga subscribe button. And then you can go ahead and save it. And then punta tayo dito sa Cute Cut Pro. Ito, yung katabi ng iMovie. Ayan. And then, let's go ahead and create a movie. So again, yung movie natin kanina. Yung outro ni Giselle. So don't forget to give this video a big thumbs Ito yung. So ito yung gagawin mo guys para mag-add ng subscribe button. Just hit this add button. Ito. And then punta tayo dun sa subscribe button na sinave natin kayo na ito. 
Ayan. Dr. Nivisenyo and subscribe hindi ka pa nakaka-subscribe. Just... So since malaki siya, you can go ahead and adjust this one. Ito. Ayan. Then you can move it around kung gusto mo dito. Then you can do that. O, oh, ayan. Okay. So you can also animate this one, guys. Ito lang yung gagawin mo. Just click this subscribe button icon. And then, hit this parang magic one. Ito. <laughs> magic one ba to? Ito. Ayan. And then, click mo yung add button. And you can see different transitions, guys. So it's up to you kung ano yung gusto mong transition sa subscribe button. For example, let's use um, up, in, and down, out. So ito yung kinalalabasan niya. And subscribe kung hindi ka pa nakaka-subscribe. Just click the red oh, button diba? down below. Or you can also use this fade in and fade out. Or kung gusto mo lang ng isang transition, then you can use maybe right in. Okay, like this. And subscribe kung ka pa nakaka-subscribe, just click the red button okay. down below. So basically, ito talaga yung dalawang apps na palagi kong ginagamit guys to edit my sister's videos. Ito talaga yung ginagamit ko since day one. Kasi ang maganda sa kanilang dalawa, hindi na babago yung quality ng video after saving it. Kasi may ibang apps na nagpipixelate yung video after saving it. So kung may mga tanong pa kayo guys, mag-comment lang kayo sa baba kung ano pa yung gusto nyong malaman for editing. Just comment down below para gawa natin yan ng video, okay? So, ang dali lang, di ba? Hope nakatulong tong video na to. Lalong-lalo na sa mga baguhan pa lang. Importante-importante talaga na maglagay ng subscribe button sa mga videos natin to remind our viewers na dapat mag-subscribe talaga sila. Kasi simula nung nag-add na ako ng subscribe button sa videos ko, sunod-sunod na yung pag-increase ng mga subscribers ko. Actually, guys, most of the time, yung mga nanonood sa atin, hindi pa sila nakapag-subscribe. So, importante-importante to remind them na mag-subscribe sila. So, guys, if may gusto pa kayo tutorial on how to edit. Mag-comment lang kayo sa baba kasi gagawa namin yun ng video ng kuya ko. So, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up kung gusto nyo and subscribe kung hindi ka pa nakaka-subscribe. Just click the red button down below and the notification bell beside para updated ka sa mga bagong i-upload kong videos. So, maraming salamat sa panunood. See you next week. Always remember that you are special. So, always wear that smile on your face.